In this video, we are going to see figure 6.7 shows planar loops of different shapes moving out of or into a region of magnetic field which is directed normal to the plane of the loop away from the reader. Determine the direction of the induced current in each loop using Lenz law. It is given that is a region of magnetic field which is directed normal to the plane of the loop that is perpendicular to the plane of the loop away from the reader. So, the magnetic field lines are moving into the plane. So, the direction of the magnetic field lines are like this. Now, we consider this ABCD plane. Its arrow mark shows this ABCD plane is moving into the magnetic field. So, magnetic flux is increased. According to Lenz law, the induced magnetic field should oppose the given magnetic field because of increasing of magnetic flux. So, this is the direction of the given magnetic field. It is away from the reader. So, the induced magnetic field direction should be towards the reader. So, it should be outward from the plane of the paper. Next, you have to keep your right hand thumb as the direction of the induced magnetic field. Then, curl the other fingers. Next, we have to apply right hand thumb rule for the direction of the induced current. What says it is? It says, if thumb shows as the direction of the induced magnetic field, then other finger shows direction of the induced current. So, here uh, thumb shows direction of the induced magnetic field. So, the other finger's direction is anti-clockwise direction. So, its a direction moves A, B, C, D. So, the direction of the induced current is A, B, C, D. Next, we consider this uh, triangle plane. Its arrow direction shows it is moving out of the region of the magnetic field. Due to this motion of the triangular plane, here magnetic field is decreased. So, magnetic flux is decreased. To overcome this uh, decrease of magnetic flux, according to Lenz law, the induced magnetic field should be as the direction of the given magnetic field. We already said this is the given magnetic field direction that is moving away from the reader. So, the induced magnetic field direction also should be moving away from the reader. Now, you have to keep your thumb, that is right hand uh, thumb, as the direction of the induced magnetic field and curl the other fingers. Next, we have to apply right hand uh, thumb rule for the induced uh, current. So, what says it is? It says, if thumb shows as the direction of the induced magnetic field, the curled fingers, that is other finger shows the direction of the induced current. So, the other fingers, that is curled finger shows a clockwise direction. So, induced current direction should be A, C, B. Next, we consider this ABCD irregular shape. Its arrow mark shows its ABCD plane is moving out of the given magnetic field. Okay. Now, the magnetic field lines are decreased. Of course, magnetic flux also decreased. According to Lenz law, the induced magnetic field should be increased. So, the induced magnetic field direction should be 
as the direction of the given magnetic field. So this is the given magnetic field direction. So the induced magnetic field direction also should be the same. Now you have to keep your right hand thumb as the direction of the induced magnetic field and curl the other fingers. Next, we have to apply right hand thumb rule for the direction of the induced current. So, if thumb shows the direction of the induced magnetic field, then other finger shows the direction of the induced current. Here, the other finger shows clockwise direction. So, it's a magnetic field the direction is clockwise. It should be A, B, C, D. I hope you understand uh, the concept very well. Thank you for watching.